this is Darcy and Arissa from TalesFromTheNursery.net. We wanted to say hello today. Are you playing peekaboo already? Good. Uh, today I wanted to talk a little bit about goals. It's the end of February. It's a good time to check in and see how we're doing with those yearly go the the New Year goals. Hey! Hi! Hey! hey. <laughs> I made a big to-do in January about... The fact that I was setting goals and not Bacon. making resolutions, which is probably a good thing because resolutions have already been broken. So why my goals? My goals aren't broken. They're just off track. Uh, if you've been following along, I'm sure you have noticed that I did not post action plans yet, which is one of the things that I stated I would be doing when I shared my <laughs> when I shared my list of personal and professional goals. I stated that I would be sharing my action plans so that it would help you uh, develop yours as well as to hold myself accountable. I'm doing a great job of holding myself accountable, aren't I? Because I have not posted them yet. So that is one thing that I have got to get done. Uh, having coming along now to the end of February and not having those action plans done has definitely been a lesson that I'm hoping that we both can learn from. I believe that the reason I am not sticking to my goals very well at this point and that I have not made very much progress is because I have not done the action plans. It's kind of important. <laughs> I worked as a case manager for like five years. One of the main things that I did was develop case plans for my clients and with my clients I should say. It wasn't really for them. I helped organize them and walk them through it. but we would put together their goals and their action steps because <laughs> that was the only way for them to be able to measure their success um, for me to help make sure that they were staying on track and you know really for it to seem realistic that they were gonna get anywhere closer to those goals you would think I would know better but as you can see I don't because I haven't gotten it done yet. Probably because I don't have my own case. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So one of the main ones that I really need to get going on is my goal of being more healthy and losing weight. I need to, you know, be in good shape for this little one. Despite the amount of, you know, running around that she, uh, causes me to do chasing her about the house and whatnot it's still not enough you know I, I need to be making, making sure I'm eating better so that it's you know a good example for her and just keeping myself healthy in general plus you know we were wanting to try to conceive number two sometime this year and I need to be healthy for that because I gotta be healthy so baby can be healthy ba 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 baby yes <laughs> And the not having put together an action plan for my health goals has been a real issue. It's allowed me to make excuses and to continue justifying, you know, stuffing my face with brownies. Um, sweets are definitely my weakness as well as, well, I have a lot of weaknesses, but <laughs> sweets are a big one. Now, I know I can't completely cut them out, but... I need to put together a plan so that I can stick to good moderation. I've done it before, but I had a plan. I had a plan, so that's what I need, is I need a plan again so that I can stay on track. <laughs> Remember what I said last time about books? Yeah. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. <laughs> so, I'd love to hear how you guys are doing with your goals. I uh, would love to hear how, you know, what those goals are. Have they changed already? I think some of my goals have actually probably changed in the past couple of months. Just purely because as I try to work on them, because even though I don't have an action plan doesn't mean I haven't done anything with them. But, you know, there's some things that have changed. Some of my priorities have changed based, <laughs> based on different things that, you know, I've come across in research for professional goals. Um, I really am not doing so good at trying to get myself more organized. I'm internally organized. It's 
all up here, but that's not the most reliable system, especially now that I'm mom, because I swear she sucked out brain cells. <laughs> um, so even though I'm internally organized, I'm not externally organized. So I really got to work on that, especially from, from a business standpoint with the blog. I, you know, I can't just keep it all in my head, especially when it comes to things like taxes. I need to have, you know, everything in order so that it's, you know, reproducible for somebody else to be able to look at and know what's going on. And getting ready, you know, for the conference for blog her in August. You know, I want to have everything all put together before then. You know, I with the, we have the new design now that's been pushed out. So I need to get my media kit together. I need to get new business cards, all that good stuff. Uh, need to take care of my LLC and all those good things too been doing some research on those things so at least I'm a little step closer I know how much it's gonna cost me so yay <laughs> that's a step in the right direction so anyway wanted to check in let you know our little update and if you haven't been doing so great with your goals don't feel so bad uh, I have not been doing so great with them either but that's okay we still got time we can still get on track and we can still make it a success have a great day